better today than yesterday. I never satisfied. I always climbing. I always try to to improve myself, do better and better and better. This is the main a main motivation. You need always to be realistic, and you need to put new goals, new focus, and of course hard work to be still the best. You have many outstanding athletes which you can consider as great. You can take Pava Nurmi, you can take Jesse Owens, you can take Carl Lewis, you can already today speak about uh, Usain Bolt, you can speak about Valery Brumel, or you can touch Yuri Sedich. It's, uh, it's so, so many, Kip Kano, and so many outstanding great champions. It's very difficult just to point one of them. Bob Beeman, 8 meter 90. This was something you really, really unique and ahead of the time. It takes 23 years when in Tokyo Michael Powell broke the record. I would consider this is one of greatest uh, moments in athletics history. Each moment has big value for me. The first World Championship title was very special, extremely, extremely tough competition. Weather condition was so bad, it was rainy, and in the final it's very windy, front wind. It was very risky to compete. I would say six meters, first time in history. And of course, Olympic Games in 88. Of course, I really was devoted to athletics. I was very focused, very professional. And I'm very happy that I brought a lot of great moments for people. Because for me, one of my main motivations from my sport career was the, 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 our fans, our spectators. When I see the full stadium, I compete for them. I act for them and try to, to do my best performance. And I was really happy. My family was happy. But the most, it's people happy. I try to, to give them these beautiful, unforgettable moments. I started from end of uh, 80s, beginning of 90s. I started really to implement, to establish Sergei Bubka Sports Club, where the kids start to, to learn athletics, organize competition. But only 10 years later, in 2000, I am retired. But already at that time, I knew this is my last Olympics. Doesn't matter how I will compete, but I will stop. This is uh, the final point of my career. And today, I'm happy to be in a sport administration. I'm very happy and pleased to give something back to sport. I'm vice president of IWF. I'm also the executive board member of International Olympic Committee and president of National Olympic Committee. We must to bring new ideas, we must to be really brave to change something and to make the best facilities for our athletes to highlight our sport. What I'm doing, it's only sport. And I am happy because this is my life.